homeless brother. Where's your cardboard box? Hey, get over here. I'm going to fill up your soup bowl. <laughs> oh, come on. You lose your sense of humor when you lost your apartment? Oh, uh, but I want to stay in my apartment, even though I can't pay my mortgage. Nah, 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 I'm all upset. <laughs> and Linda, look at you. Your body is ridiculous. Ah. <laughs> You've been working out. My God. Yeah. Thank you. Rick, I think you're making everybody uncomfortable. Oh, everybody <laughs> okay. knows what I mean. Hey, Tanner, come out here and say hello to your aunt and uncle. Hi, Uncle George and Linda. Hey, Tanner. Hi, wow, you're so big. I don't like so. I'm not like five years old anymore. Ha <laughs> ha, it's such a freaking shocker. <laughs> Funny. Yeah. What a What's that over there? Is that a margarita machine? Oh. I thought you rented construction equipment. I do. Porta potties. What do you think? Construction work is hold it in all day? You know, here's a little business model for you, Mr. New York Fancy Pants. They shit, I rake it in. Cha ching. Cha ching. What are you grossed out by money? Here you go, shithead. Simple data entry. Uh, do they still use computers in New York City? Yeah. You want me to uh, enter this data? Are you questioning me? Don't question me. Here, you're not my brother. You're not my buddy. You're my employee. You're my employee. Got it? Are you serious? I'm. Am I serious? You're fired. You're rehired. Okay. Consider that a warning shot. <clears throat> Get to work, Paco. Watch this guy. All right. Do me a favor. Keep your eye on Paco because I don't trust these people. Okay. It's kind of funny. Because when we were kids, George used to mooch off me. And now that we're all grown up, the mooching has begun again. You win, Rick. You got a big house. You're a big success. You're the winner. Oh, come on. You know I'm being a dick to be a dick. I'm just being a dick to be a dick. Family's family, right? My little brother needs a job. I hook him up. I'm looking for something on my own, actually. In this economy? You think you're going to find something, do you? Here comes the lecture. Here comes... Here comes the le... No. All right, then I'll shut up. I'll shut up. You know what? I'll shut up. Because I don't want to lecture you. Mm -hmm. In my own house! God damn it! Okay, you know what? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I apologize. Okay? But can I give you can I give you one piece of advice? You're doing it wrong. Rick, come can on. Can I get a word in edgewise here? You come to my house crawling for help. What do I do? I open my door to you. Can I please have some more mimosa juice? Marissa, please, mimosa juice. You know, you don't have a goddamn clue how to live life. I gave you a gift, and you think you can do better? Who else do you know who owns their own company? So what if it's the doo-doo business? All right, you want this? This is how you get it. Forget what you think and do what I say. I pulled down six figures, George. You should listen to me. But you just talk, 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 talk. Who knows how many days any of us have on this earth? I want to fill mine with laughter, happiness, and love. Let's get the fuck out of here. Linda, take off your robe. We're leaving. No, dude, upstairs with your, with your, uh, your other clothes. Come on. Okay. Are you guys going to be back for dinner? <laughs> I just figured out what George's fortune cookie fortune would say. Uh, Confucius say, when wife screw other guy, husband must get rid of wife. She no good. Ooh, what a poor fried rye. <laughs> what exactly did mom do to you that she didn't do to me? Oh, come on. I know it's offensive, but you got to admit, it's funny. That's funny. I'm not Chinese. That's funny. All I'm saying is Linda's no good. Screw her. Screw those hippy dippies with their B.O. and their white dreads. You have no idea, man. Okay. <laughs> um, so you're complaining about Linda? You're the one who wanted to sleep with other people. I didn't think she'd say yes. Bingo. At least she had permission before she cheated. My husband's been fucking at least one woman on the side ever since before our wedding. What? What is that supposed to mean? You have a tracking system in your car. You never shut up about it, stupid. Little reality shift, huh, Rick? Honey, no, 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 no. Listen to me. I love you and I have sex with other women because I love you so much. I'm getting it out of my system. I'm trying to protect you. Are you kidding me? What do you want me to do? Do you want me to tell you every time I sleep with somebody? And then what? Then we have to deal with that every time? What is wrong with you? George, back me up on this. What are you doing? What's that face here? Why are you doing that? Are you pooping? No. 
I'm crying. That's not what crying looks like. Hey, what do you want me to do? You want if you get the fuck out of my house and out of my life forever, that's it. Okay, thanks. Get out. You're taking my infidelity and making it about you. Do you realize how selfish you sound? This is exactly why I have to cheat. I hate you. I want a divorce. No, honey, no. I left no. my wife at a commune. No, what the fuck about. am I thinking? I'm auditioning for Real Housewives of Atlanta. Are these your car keys? Yes. Wait, no, no! <laughs> what are you doing with my car? What are you doing with my car? We're a family. It's our car. Get out of the goddamn car! My baby's alive, I got left!